Oh man, arm beers, we have some anthill eggs being laid right now. Arm beers, we have our anthill pythons that we've been breeding, and one of them, a female, is just starting to lay some eggs. She laid a few. Is one of the females laying eggs, not one of the males? Let's hope. So, <laughs> she's, she laid a few um, slugs so far, and she's still really chubby. So you can see a couple of those slugs just hanging out there. We're hoping that she just starts popping out eggs. Oh man, I'm so excited. We weren't sure exactly when she was gonna lay, but we knew it was coming up soon, so. We have one more that uh, should be laying not too far behind, so. We'll update you guys on that once they all come out. So we're right in the middle of egg laying season, guys, and we have a clutch in the incubator that's gonna be coming out on the second week of May. Right, April, May? Mm -hmm. Am I getting my numbers right? Get about there. <laughs> I got a whole bunch of egg boxes set up in here because we're about to get loaded up with eggs. Mm -hmm. But this group right here, we're waiting on. How many is that? Six? That is six. Six eggs from a killer leopard clown to a spider blade het clown. Obviously, mm -hmm. we want a bunch of clown females that we can hold back. Yeah. So wish us luck on that. We'll definitely keep you updated on this clutch. Uh, can't wait to start doing some clutch reveals. So yeah, we're gonna be having some uh, baby snake reveals, <laughs> smoke bombs, and everything. Stay tuned for that. No, not me. So here we have a really exciting product that we just got into, guys. These are from our buddy Limey Smidger over that Limey Smidger ballpythons.com. <laughs> Will Reptilia. <laughs> anyway, you know if you know him, you know he's really into the paint project. And now we are. So that's right. What we have here is a pair of paint yellow bellies. And we have a pastel OD het paint female. So these things are really beautiful. Look at these bellies. Ooh. Super awesome. Back in the day, they used to call this a codon project, but we are now reframing it as a recessive because there are some visual cues to being a het paint that people used to call. Uh, Sentinel? Well, there's different lines. So, yeah. but, um, it, was a pretty, it, would be, it would be paint and super paint is what it yeah. was. And yeah. then, then they went to paint is the full recessive, two copies, and het paint is one copy. Mm -hmm. But um, as you can see, there's a slight difference to a, a pastel OD with the het. But like, it, it's so sketchy. Sometimes you just can't tell. But having it as recessive, I think fits a lot better. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, we're definitely really excited about this project. Um, this pair about. is such a powerhouse. Even if we bred these two together from strictly like a breeder standpoint, producing all visual paints that are possible, uh, sorry, I'm getting lined up here, <laughs> <laughs> that are all like we could get ivory paints. So while they'd be all white snake, would definitely, since it's paint to paint, they'd be 100% paint. It, they'd definitely a paint. So like now you have something that's gonna 100% pass on the paint gene and yellow belly. So while it may not be like a visually appealing thing to do from, you know, an artistic perspective, from mm -hmm. a business standpoint, it's a, you know, it's a powerhouse combo, you crank some genes out, you know? Mm -hmm. Guaranteed winners. And definitely putting that male to this female. So you'd get pastel, orange dream, yellow belly paints, visual paints. Hopefully, uh, and 100% head paints, of course. That you would. So. So there's, seems like we're in a new project every other day. So, <laughs> yeah. you know, just trying to keep you guys up to date. Uh, also, since we have all these extra snakes now, we got to buy some cages. So we just put in our order for ARS for another couple of racks. Mm-hmm. I don't know where we're going to fit them at just yet, but. <laughs> 
We're gonna worry about that once we uh, we're staring doing? the problem in the face. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. these animals are awesome. And yeah, thank you so much to Limey. We actually bought these. Um, I think in like November or something like that. But it just we didn't get a good weekend to ship them, and he's real cautious, which we really like. And uh, so we waited until a few weeks ago when it started to warm up a month ago maybe and um he's just he has awesome animals we've purchased from him several times and uh just love these animals little shout out to uh Brittany gobble though too because it wasn't until i saw a picture of one of hers that i was like wow that's maybe i need to really rethink this we've been talking about getting into the paint project for a long time but uh finally finally in and she got hers from Limey too. So. And she did, yeah. There you go. So, very so cool. That was like, you know, cruising through Tinder. We swiped left. Or was it a swipe right? What, how you, how That's you, how you pick up is swipe right. You swipe right. I don't know that. So you swipe right on the uh, old uh, paint project. Yes, sir. Make sure you smash the like button. I want to show you guys one of one, uh, one of the things everybody asks is, oh, what's your exciting pairings? What is your exciting? We actually have a lot. Um, the double head tri-stripe lavender albinos is in the top five of our crazy pairings, I think. But it's double head to double head, which is going to be fun. Uh, but this pairing here is going to be awesome as well. So we have this male is a pastel yellow belly leopard spot nose het clown male. And he's pretty. He's, you know, more than a Batman maker. And he's going to two females, so I'll show you the good one. They're both good. But he's going to two females. I'll show you this one first. She is looking huge. So this is from Bob Vu, our clown. It's a visual clown, you can see. Visual clown, banana. And it has pastel too? Yes, pastel. So this says paste. It's a paste. <laughs> it's a pastel banana clown, visual clown. So pastel banana visual clown female. So, you know, making some Batman stuff, and this is a visual to a het, so we have a 50% chance of hitting clowns. For some reason I feel like it would be better odds, but you think so, but statistically, still it's he only has a 50% chance, chance of passing the clown, right? True. Genetics. But it is always better to have a visual to it. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, some Batman, banana, super pastel stuff. I mean, I hope we don't hit too many super pastels, but it's going to be a crazy, crazy pairing. So, that's, that's pretty nuts, right? It's going to be fun, but let me show you the other animal that he's paired to and see what you guys think. So this is the other animal that he's paired to. This is a black pastel, pastel, butter, coral glow, het clown female. So it's a black pewter, coral glow, butter, het clown female. Man. So think about those possibilities. You got this crazy pattern, and let's hope that we hit all clowns. I'm right next door. Okay. Let's see. They've been lovers lately. I don't want them to get started because they just ate. So we give them a couple days. But black pastel, coral glow. The yellow belly, black pastel, super pastel, lesser. Coral glow. So it's <laughs> Scarecrow actually, because Coral glow, Batman. It's a uh, it's a lot yeah. going on. All that jazz. So yeah, yeah. I'm not always the best with what things are named. Look, man, I'm gonna put you back in a second here. Don't be getting all cuddled up. All getting cuddled up. So this is a crazy pairing. I mean, really, unbelievable stuff. So you guys gotta make sure you keep an eye on us. That pastel banana clown female is getting huge. Um, she's gonna be laying eggs soon. And this girl is definitely building. She, I don't think she ovulated yet, but man, can't wait. We got some amazing pairings going on over here. So 
stay tuned for those things. Make sure you guys are watching some of these crazy videos that we have putting up here. We have, uh, you know, a video from us that you guys would probably like and a couple of our other channels so you can see uh, Herb House Rock and R&B Reptiles Shorts. Make sure you guys subscribe. So we'll see you on the next one.